In October of last year, Minister Simon Harris launched Speak Out. This is an online anonymous reporting tool for all students and staff to report incidents of bullying, violence and sexual harassment. Speak Out is in all higher education institutes in the Republic of Ireland and is available for all staff and students to take the first step to alerting senior management within an institute to potential problem of a very serious nature. Speak Out represents a national approach to tackling these issues by raising awareness and by providing a means of recording incidents, which will assist to achieving zero tolerance culture. Let's have a look at the Speak Out promotional video. Bullying. Cyberbullying. Harassment. Discrimination. Hate crimes. Coercive behaviour. Stalking. Assault. Sexual harassment. Sexual assault. Rape. Speak Out is an online anonymous reporting tool for all members of our college community to speak out about their experiences and find the relevant supports for them. We believe you. We stand with you. And we will support you. I wanted to hear from some of our own students what they thought of such a platform and would they use it. What do you think of the launch of this new tool? Uh, I think it's a fantastic tool for students. Uh, I think it should be available by all students. It gives them nice confidence and privacy to talk about their problems without having to go face to face with a person if they don't feel comfortable doing it. If you were bullied on campus, what would you do? Um, I probably wouldn't know what to do, I suppose. Um, speaking to the welfare officer from the SU probably would be my first approach um, or maybe going to my class rep, I suppose. Um, would be kind of the way I'd go for it. And if there was an online anonymous tool to report this, would you use it? 100% yeah, it'd be the first place I'd go. I suppose it'd be easier because it'd be anonymous and it would probably help me a lot more. If you were sexually assaulted on campus, what would you do? To be honest, I don't know what I'd really do, but I would probably tell a close friend, even though I'd be afraid to tell a close friend. Um, I'd report to the guards straight away, but I wouldn't want anybody else to know type of thing, because people do go around making up stories, and some people might say that I'm lying and stuff like that, and I wouldn't want rumours going around, so I'd probably just keep it to myself type of thing, let a close friend know, and yeah, the guards. So if there was an online anonymous reporting tool, would you use that? Yeah, I definitely would, 100%. Yeah, I think that would be better because people wouldn't know that it's you saying it, you know? If there was an online anonymous tool to report these incidents, would you encourage your friend to use it or would you use it yourself to report it? Yeah, absolutely, because there could be... Um it can be hard for people to come out and speak about these kind of things as well. It can be some people might find it a bit embarrassing or a bit of a heavy heavy load to be unloading on somebody else face to face. So I think the online tool would be a great idea. Speak Out is also available for staff as well as students, and I wanted to talk to Alan, DKIT Pastoral Care, to find out what he thought about Speak Out. I think it's an important first step and I think acknowledging that something bad has happened to them and as well it might be an easier approach to report it anonymously. Some people might feel scared about going to a guard station or speaking to someone about it so I think it's a helpful way to report something wrong that has happened to somebody. I, I think it would help those who have a duty to, to students and staff to understand where there may be issues and that they can investigate further in relation to sexual violence or harassment. So I'd advise any student or staff member to speak out using the Speak Out tool. I would also advise them to confide in any person of responsibility if they're being bullied or sexually harassed.